Hey, God bless you, my friend and sister Sharon. And today I want to give you three things to consider when you do not feel like studying the Bible or reading the Bible. And sometimes even with your time of communication to God, I believe that there are seasons where God is maturing you and I, and we need to walk in his rest. The number one thing I want you to consider when you do not feel like reading the scriptures though, is it is normal. When you eat food, beloved, and you are full, because the word of the Lord is like meat to us. It fills us. And when you are constantly eating food, at some point you don't want any more because you are, you, you're full. And you need time for it to do what? Digest. To become a part of you. Take time, my friend, to, to, to realize this is normal. Number two, do not beat yourself up. Whatever you do, my friend, don't do that. Number three, enjoy pondering what you already know. Beloved, this is how you begin to memorize scripture and it becomes a part of you because you give yourself time to meditate on what you already have in you. This is how Follow me, my friend, when food is digested, especially fatty foods, what does it do? It will take up residence. It becomes a part of you and you become, you become weighty and you got, as we say, meat on your bones. Well, in the spirit, friends, when you consider the meditation of the word of the Lord, it becomes fat on you. It becomes spiritually attached to you. And without you realizing, there are times you just be quoting what you have been meditating on because that is the beauty of the word of the Lord. Give it time to become a part of you, my friend. And, and this is where you will learn to rest and not beat yourself up because it may be that you're so full, you can't take nothing in. And the Holy Ghost wants you to just Settle down and let that word become flesh where it is forever abiding in you. Because let's face it, friends, we don't know what's around the corner where you may not be able to purchase Bibles, to read Bibles in certain countries that's already taken place where you could be persecuted, you could be put in jail. Friends, listen, how did the prophets get a hold to what God was always saying to them? Meditation pondering it. So this could be a moment where you need to do exactly that. Let it masticate in you. Let it become a part of you. Eat it. Let it rehearse in your heart and your mind what you already know. God bless you, my friend. Enough said till next time. Be encouraged.